it finally feels so good out here in San Diego. I have on shorts and a short sleeve shirt. I have not been able to wear shorts in I don't know how long. It feels good out here. I'm so excited. Um, but yeah, welcome back to my channel. It's a new vlog. It's a new start to a video. If you don't know who I am, my name is Lashante, or you can call me Tay. Subscribe, 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 because I would love to have you a part of my family. Um, follow me on Instagram too, because I'll be on there too. Um, and yeah, welcome back to another vlog. So, in this vlog, um, Navea just had her graduation. If you haven't watched that graduation vlog, stop and go watch that vlog, okay? Um, so it's the weekend, and we decided to have a little taco Tuesday night. And um, yeah, so some family's gonna come over. I'm gonna be cooking. I have beef tacos and then I have pork tacos. So I need to get, I have a list actually, and I need to add to the list. Um, yeah, I need to add a couple things to the list. I need to get rice, cause I'm, I have beans at home. But I think I'm gonna do beans and rice too, cause why not? So let me add that to the list. Why aren't you smacking like that? That's just how you go. Um, rice. Roll two. And I need to get foil pans. Um, from the dollar store. Anyways, y'all, here goes my list. Y'all probably can't see, but it says tacos right there. So I have a list of things that I need to get. Um, you know what happened to the games? Yeah. I need three more. Oh, so we don't have none? Yeah, because you threw them away. All the games? Yeah. I said I threw more. Maybe I did. Maybe I didn't. I don't remember. I know we had Uno. I look white, like ashy. I don't really like my makeup today, but we're going to roll with it. Otherwise, I'm going to get depressed. So I'm just not even going to acknowledge that. Uh, yeah. Okay, y'all. First stop is Dollar Tree. And I need to get foil. Let me put y'all right here. Here go the foil pants. Right here, so we're about to get foil pants. Hold on. All right. I just need... Okay. I wanted to get one for um, cheese, sour cream, and lettuce and tomatoes and stuff. I guess I could put it on here. Should I get that or one with a lid? Oh, it comes with two. Oh, perfect. I think these two would be good. I need tomatoes. I didn't put tomatoes on the list. Okay, let me put tomatoes on the list because I already forgot about tomatoes. They be having so much stuff in Dollar Tree. I be <laughs> feeling like a kid in the candy store. Uh, I think that's all I needed from here. Ooh, they got stuff for cocktails. Let me show y'all. Ooh, strawberry margarita. They got lime. Mojito. Not me wanting to buy one. <laughs> I don't want to buy one. Strawberry margarita mixers. My aunt's gonna be making drinks, so I probably don't need this. And it's zero calories. It's sugar free. That's good. Um, now I'm thinking about dessert. I don't need no dessert, child.
Ooh, a banana pudding sounds good. I do know. <laughs> we at the next location. And uh, I can already see they don't have what I need. How much this is? Three dollars. Get one of those, or get one of these, a two-dollar one. I am home. I think I got everything I need. Well, I hope I did because I'm not going back out if I didn't. But, yeah. Um, I'm going to start cooking because I have the meat and stuff right here. I'm going to start cooking the meat in about an hour. Yeah, I'm going to cook the meat in about an hour. So, yep. That is that. Then I gotta cut the vegetables up, tomatoes, onion, and then I got some tortillas. They're pretty much already warm, but I doubt they stay warm. And then I got some rice for rice and beans. Rice and beans. And then I got a cake, a little mini cake. It is a Danish butter cake. Sounds so good. So we're gonna see how that tastes. But yeah, a little cake for dessert. Purr it. I got some taco sauce, because if y'all don't fuck with the taco sauce, I mean, who are you? Who are you? How about these beers? These Angry Orchid. And I don't like them. I used to like them, but I don't like them no more. Like, I used to hella like them, but mm -mm, not anymore. I ain't I like it. And this spicy guacamole, I hope it's good. I hope it's good. Um, I yeah. to pop open this beer even though I don't like it. I bought it so I'm gonna finish it. But I really don't. It kind of got like a, a vinegary taste. So that's why I don't really like it anymore. I used to like them. I got my taco seasoning out. So I got this Taco Bell seasoning, this one, and then I got this McCormick one. So I'm gonna use both. Let's cut the tomato. Time 
it's gonna be you So this is a, um, what's this auntie? Tequila Sunrise. Tequila Sunrise. It looks like a sunrise too. I feel like I'm in Jamaica, man. Yeah. <laughs> so all of your, I'm going to let you taste it first. So all of the sweet is at the bottom. You didn't even stir it up. I didn't know. You didn't tell me. Let me get it. It's a straw. I mean, the uh, First the weird stuff. You didn't say that. You just said taste it. Well, who don't taste a mixed drink before? Who don't start a mixed drink before they taste it? I don't know. <laughs> Clearly. <laughs> mm. That's so I can more? taste the uh, liquor. I'm about to ask if you need some more. How can I make it a, little, a tad bit more sweeter? Mm. Miss, I want to taste the liquor. Okay, cool. Now I feel like I should put some more Yvette's already. Well, she might like, uh, you like your strong Yvette? Uh-huh. For me. It's possible. You got it. Thank mm. you, mm. my Sunday. Um, me and Neve are about to get ready to go to church. I'm about to figure something out with my hair. And I'm making a quick breakfast real quick. I had about this. <clears throat> my voice just went out probably from last night. We had fun. a lot of fun last night but it sounded like my voice going out um yeah so i'm making this real this quick little jimmy dean sausage bowl that i'll be buying from the store it has um bacon eggs potatoes and it's actually pretty good especially when you want to rush you know, it's, it's pretty good. And then I made some hash browns and sausage from Trader Joe's. So, yeah. That's what we're having for breakfast. I got about an hour to get ready. Just lift your hands and sing. Oh, I know that. Okay, y'all, we are in the car apparently. Oh, it's a little hot. You know, we were just complaining about how it was so cloudy. Now it's getting a little warm. Yeah, so we got about 10 more minutes until we got to be to church. So you already know where I'm stopping. Right now. I ain't know. Even though yesterday I didn't drink no coffee, and so I'm trying to cut back on coffee. I say that every time. But no, for real, I didn't have no coffee yesterday, and so today I could go without coffee. 
but something is pulling me. Something is pulling me to the coffee. Anyways, happy Father's Day. Um, happy Sunday, you guys. It was playing Sorry. I've never played Sorry before. Have y'all played Sorry before? The game Sorry, I've never played that game before, but apparently everybody was cheating. Well, Nevaeh was cheating. I was not cheating. Justin was cheating. And yeah, did you even vlog any of that? See, this girl want to be a vlogger, but don't vlog nothing. I'm trying to vlog today. Well, you was having fun yesterday. Why didn't you vlog yesterday? Because I just wanted to live in the moment with That's my family. True. That's true, but usually when I want to live in a moment, I just set the camera up and just, you know, let it play. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, Nevaeh's trying to vlog. Are you just trying to vlog on the skate world after that? You done vlogging? No, I'm saying like I'm trying to get into it and like this is the first step. I'm trying to get back into like YouTube life. So this is the first step? So what if you don't go? You're not gonna vlog? I'll still vlog. Mm -hmm. She wanna go to Skate World. I'm trying to decide if I wanna go to Skate World because Skate World is far. It's like thirty minutes from us. Maybe. I checked. It's only like 21 minutes. That's far. So we'll see how I'm feeling after church. I need to go home and clean up. Uh, that's what I need to do. But yeah, we'll see y'all later. I ain't got shit to talk about, so I'll see y'all later. Peace. Y'all see me? I don't know why it seems like it's a little walk. I think y'all can see me. Anyways, y'all, it is time later um, after church. I went home and my camera blurry. I'm just making sure my camera isn't blurry. But yeah, I went home, went to church, and I was cleaning. Um, I was cleaning from last night. I wanted to make sure the house was clean, and then I came and took the girls to Nevaeh and her friend to uh, Skate World. So that's what we're doing now. Um, I was going to go in and skate, but I really don't know how to skate. <laughs> yeah, y'all. I don't know. I know how to skate, but I'm going to be falling. Like, I'm going to just be like, Ugh. And so, I'm, and probably they don't want their mom in there. So, I, you know, it's a little girl's thing. Teenagers. So, I'll just sit out here and wait for them. Um, let them skate for a couple hours. But there's a Pizza Hut next door. And I've been wanting to try the Melt, the new Melt pizza or whatever. It looks bomb. It looks crunchy. It looks really, really good. So I'm going to be a fat ass. Try the milk. And then there's a, dump, a, yum, yum, a yum yum donuts over here that I'm also going to try. So we going to sit, chat, eat, little mukbang or whatever while we wait for the girls. Because the skate world is like 30 minutes from my house. I'm not going to drop them off and then go back all the way home. and then I'm, I'm not doing that. Nobody got gas for all that. So I'm going to sit around and wait for them. I am close to the mall. Um, but I don't, I'm not going to go to the mall because I ain't got money to be spending. So we ain't going to go to the mall. We're just going to sit around and wait and watch vlogs. Yeah. Pizza Hut. Y'all, here's the melts I've been wanting to try. It looks really, really good. So let's try that. Let's go in. Okay, y'all, so they said 20 minutes for the pizza milk or whatever. So I'm walking over here to Yum Yum Donuts to get some donuts. Well, yeah. Oh, and they have a supermarket. Uh, uh, oh. Ooh, they have a Thai a Asian supermarket. Oh, my gosh, you guys. I'm going. I'm going. Yeah, I want to go see what they have on there. What they have in there it looked close anyways i haven't been in the asian supermarket in i don't know how long and i want to go but anyways here is yum yum donuts let's go in here Thank you. Hi. 
we have when I do So the guy said for um, the pizza, it's gonna take 20 minutes for the melt wrap, the little melt thing. So, I'm like 20 minutes. But I wanna go in these stores. So, since I'm gonna be sitting here waiting, I'm gonna go, after I eat, I'm gonna go um, into one of those stores and see and check it out because it's still early. Um, yeah, because I really wanna go. I love making pho. So they probably got all the fucking recipes. So we gonna go in there and check it out, y'all. This area, this is the Linda Vista area and this is where they be having like all uh, you know, the Asian stuff like that, Asian town. So it's really, really quiet over here. I'm surprised it's not a lot of kids out here. It's probably quiet in the um, skating ring. But I'll wait 20 minutes for my pizza. I'll tell you, you shouldn't have got no damn soda. Nonetheless, I got two different kind of donuts. This one, I don't even know what it's called. Mm. It's thick as fuck. I probably should have. I probably should be um, waiting to eat my pizza first before I start eating donuts. Ain't that what we tell our kids? Like, mm -mm. you need to eat food before you eat junk. And I'm over here doing what I be telling my kids not to do. But I'm hungry. All right, y'all. We back. We got our pizza milk. This is what it's looking like. This is what it's looking like. Oh my gosh, it looks bomb. A little crispy though. I ain't gonna hold you. It's hot. Look, y'all. Oh. It's hot. Y'all see that? He made mine a little too crispy. I don't know. They, it comes with sauce. I'm guessing it's marinara sauce. Yeah, marinara sauce. So you could dip it. So let's just give it another with the sauce. It's okay. Hey y'all, so it has been like an hour later and I am in the car, clearly. Still just chilling, watching vlogs. Um, I was supposed to go to the little Asian store and go walk around and see what they got, but girl, I got the items after eating a little piece of, piece of stuff. So the kids have about 30 more minutes until we about to go. So, but yeah, I just wanted to check in with y'all. I haven't been doing anything. Um, yeah, I was going to go in a skating ring and check on them, be with them. But I was like, they don't want to, they want to be like teenagers and have time to themselves. So I'm going to give that to them. <laughs> but yeah, I ain't doing nothing. I ain't, this eye is bothering me. 
I don't know why. I feel like I need to go take out my contacts. And, yeah, close my eyes and go to sleep. I don't know what it is. It sucks wearing contacts. If you wear contacts, you know, you know. But, like, it gets annoying. Anyways, uh, yeah. It's almost the end of the day. I love this little daylight savings. Like, it don't get dark till like, 7 o'clock. Or maybe even later. 7.30. And I'm here for it. I forgot to tell y'all what church was about this morning. So, we had a guest speaker. He was, like, um, a... Uh, a, a in his past life, he was a cartel or a drug, something to do with drugs. He was a big, one of them gun lords from New York, some shit. You know, he had a past, and he was talking about his past and how, you know, God took him from that being a sinner into now a Christian and, you know, following the path of God and, and you know, doing that type of thing. So the moral of the story was have faith and... um put God first you know he was saying he was gonna be sentenced to prison doing x amount of years and one day he got a hold of a bible and started reading up to the bible and what a quince that day ever since that day he knew God him and God it just became a closer relationship or whatever um and so yeah that was a more of the story and it really spoke to me because I'm in a time and in, in place in my life where I am so vulnerable and you guys probably don't see it on the vlog and you but guys probably don't sometimes don't even realize the things I be going through inside of my head and you know the things I go through on a day to day basis and y'all probably just think I'm handling it so well and um, I'm trying not to get emotional now but I'm like in a, in a stage in my life um where I, I'm so vulnerable and so delicate with my life and my feelings and all that, you know, and, you know, the message just said, you know, to trust God and have faith and, um, you know, where I'm at in my life. And I think I told y'all before in the vlog, like, you know, this whole healing journey and not having um, the, the family that I thought I would have and, you know, moving forward with that. I always tell you all the time, it's not the easiest. And, you know, some days and some weeks and some months, I might be fine. And then some days I just be sad and, you know, needing to cry. And at first I didn't used to like to cry, but now I'll be like, I need to cry. I need to cry, especially when my kids are not. And I didn't feel in that need now. Like, I've been feeling like I need to cry. And... You know, once you cry, sometimes you get over it. Some people, I used to think, like, don't cry. Crying is not good. But sometimes you need to cry. And I've been even, I've been needing to cry lately, but it just hasn't been coming out crying. You know, it's just been, I've been, you know, like I said, my emotions are really vulnerable. And so I just, at this time, I need to, you know, ask God to just give me understanding and patience you know because sometimes it can be hard and we will look back at this footage and be like wow look how far i came and i'm so grateful but at the end of the, end of the day this is my journey and god has a plan for me and i know that and it's just like i, I know god has a plan and he has greatness for me and you know and, it's just a matter of patience. And so make sure y'all subscribe to follow me along on my journey. Um, and for y'all of uh, for y'all who don't know the backstory, um, my name is Lashante and I recently got out of a relationship I was in with my youngest. Y'all seen if y'all see Trinity on my vlogs. My youngest child's father, I used, I recently just got, not recently, it's been a while, a little while, I just got out of a relationship with that person, um, and so I'm on this journey, and um, 
it's not the first time we've broken up. Like broke, we've broken up, and then I went back, went back. I went back a lot of times actually, and um, just being transparent um, because it does happen, and you know, I already know that that relationship is not what is in store for me because I don't see that relationship in my future. When I look at my future and I see myself, I don't see that relationship. So why I keep going back, I don't know. But um so yeah, I just I got out of the relationship. So I'm in the process of healing my healing journey. And I don't talk about it as often, but just so y'all have a backstory, I'm in the process of healing and finding my happiness and under trying to under and I am in therapy and I'm trying to understand why I make the decisions I make and, and do some of the things that I do and how to avoid situations and keep making the same mistakes. So we're on that journey together. So that's pretty much it. So anybody going through that journey, don't think you're alone, boo, because you're not. I have two children. I have a 13-year-old and I have a three-year-old. And I'm very thankful for my journey. I'd be like, I don't know what I would do without my kids. Like, I love my kids so much. Like, I just love my kids. You ever just love something so much? I love my kids so, so much. So in that aspect, I am thankful for the fathers and giving them to me because I'm just thankful for them. I really am. My kids are my everything, so. <sighs> yeah anyways enough of me talking y'all and look at these do y'all see this this black line on my face when I tell you the devil is working because the devil is working what the fuck like you would think I burnt myself but I didn't burn myself so anytime I get acne and it doesn't go the way it's supposed to it leaves black black marks now i don't know if what happened if my head scarf was dirty and it was a bunch of bumps like white bumps right here i don't know what that was i think that was my first time ever having it and it left a black mark i don't know if that was because my head scarves are dirty when i do my makeup and i don't and i didn't clean it and so it broke out and i'm just so sad like look at that so can y'all please leave me a comment on how i can get rid of the dark that dark mark i'm just it's really unfortunate but what can i do oh, y'all okay. i am home oh my hair i put that um free what that that's some type of spray Free spray? I don't know. The even or the even spray. That's for wigs. And it made my hair hard, which it's supposed to do. I need to um, wash it again. <sighs> so. Yeah, that's what it's looking like. And I, when I get done with the whole long hair era... I'm cutting my hair again to like right here. I'm cutting it. What is that? Yeah, I'm cutting it. <sighs> Cause I like long hair, but not my hair. I used to, but not anymore. I'm not, I'm not into that anymore. Yeah, but I hope y'all enjoy spending the weekend with me or whatever. I'm tired. I don't have nothing planned for the rest of the evening, so I'm just going to chill, turn on the movie. I haven't found nothing good to watch on Netflix, but I'm going to try to find something. But yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this weekend vlog. If you did, give it a big old thumbs up. Like the video. Either y'all never comment, so if you don't comment, like the video or thumbs the video down like either or just put in some type of engagement even if you don't leave a comment just like it okay so like the video um subscribe if you're not what else so that's pretty much it i'll talk to you guys all in the next video i love you guys and peace
peace. Bye, you guys.